And another big story, this time in East Harlem, a licensed daycare busted inside of an apartment. Cops say they found weapons and a ghost gun printer. This comes less than two weeks after four children attending a daycare in the Bronx were treated for opioid poisoning. One of the babies died in that case. Tom Negevin is live at the scene in East Harlem with details on the gun operation. Tom? Right, Sade, that daycare on the fifth floor of this East Harlem apartment building. Off camera, residents tell us there have been complaints about the operator's son, 18 year old Karan Coley, who is charged along with two minors and expected to be arraigned tonight. There are two finished handguns, a nearly complete assault pistol, and the business part of a fourth weapon, the receiver. Our investigation began with a group of individuals, including some minors, who are purchasing ghost gun parts from online retailers. It's not just what they are, it's where police found them. It does not uh, give us uh, any joy in coming here to talk about another case where a home daycare uh, provider had children in a dangerous environment. The daycare licensed to this apartment, a small sign on the door for parents. You'd expect neighbors to be shocked, but... Doesn't surprise me. Residents here recall all too well the last crime scene at a city daycare in the Bronx where drugs were recovered, children sickened, and one-year-old Nicholas Dominici died of apparent fentanyl exposure. These uh, new methods of creating unsafe environments demand that we stay ahead of those who are doing terrible things in centers where we place our, our children. At this point, the daycare operator has not been charged, just her 18-year-old son and two minors. However, police say the investigation is still ongoing. More charges are possible. The NYPD also says it has recovered almost 300 3D printed weapons on the streets of New York so far this year.